As of April 17, 2022, St. has diagnosed a total of 23,111 cases in country, with 70 active cases presently. The daily infection rate for the last seven days is 6.8 per 100,000 population per day, which represents a 7% increase from last week, with an 11% average testing positivity rate and a transmission rate of 1.2. We've noted a total of 367 COVID-19 deaths. We have nine positive COVID-19 cases admitted at the respiratory hospital. This past week, we continue to register cases daily. We note increases in our public health indicators. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs recently received new gene sequencing results from the Caribbean Public Health Agency, CAFA. The results indicate the presence of both the Omicron BA1 and BA2 lineages. The Omicron variant BA1, which has been circulating since February 2022, was confirmed in 11 of the samples sequenced. Two cases of the Omicron BA2 variant was confirmed. Of the two cases of the Omicron BA2 diagnosed, one is a male national from Ancillary and one is a female non-national from Grosley. The Omicron BA2 variant is responsible for the new waves noted in Barbados, Martinique, and the developed countries. The Omicron variant remains the dominant variant circulating globally and has replaced all of the other circulating variants in most countries. Although there is reduced SARS-CoV-2 testing globally from the beginning of 2022, the COVID-19 pandemic continues with intense transmission and death, particularly in high-risk populations and the unvaccinated. The Pfizer, AstraZeneca, Johnson & Johnson and Moderna vaccines are available at the various wellness centers. The booster vaccine is also available for persons who have been fully vaccinated for over six months. Everyone who has not been vaccinated is urged to get vaccinated urgently. As we strive to live safely with COVID-19 and remove restrictive measures and open up the country, it is important that our public health protective measures are in place, especially to protect the most vulnerable. The Ministry of Health appeals to all organizations, public and private sector, to ensure the maintenance of the public health protocols. Let us strive to sustain the low number of COVID-19 cases as we live, work, study and recreate safely with COVID-19.